okay, whoopty crossman. It's to the point where it will run and drive. Just a bit of a spoiler. Um, I didn't do a spoiler off a of video. I did a spoiler for the short. But uh, let's uh, give it a quick ride around the yard and run it through some gears. Probably something that it really hasn't had done in a very long time. Reverse was a bit sticky, but uh, it did go into forward. But I went to the higher gear instead of the lower gears. The air filter is in there, but it has the wrong filter. So it just has to sit like that for now. I got the little knob for the top sitting in there. If it flies off, it flies off, not a big deal. So we're in neutral. Let's uh, hook up the fuel pump. The idle circuit's not working in the carburetor, but we'll live with it. disconnect the fuel pump definitely took off a little bit quicker than I was expecting the clutch does need to be lubricated it's currently stuck to the floor um, shifting seems to be fine this does have 23s on the back stock is 20s and I believe it's this one right here back left is a little bit flat yeah it's the back left but it actually it actually worked and it worked halfway decent so that's the main thing it did work um i can actually move this machine around now and get to different spots without having to push it constantly uh, i'm thinking that the brake may have may have loosened up uh it did have one of the axle keys out so i decided to put that back in before i took it for a ride but hey it seems to work and I almost hit the golf cart it didn't seem like it wanted to stop pretty quickly but it did stop eventually which worked out good let's just see if it'll start up and run on what's in the carburetor <laughs> hmm. I shot it back off just so uh, just to see if it would go or not but um, Next is to dig into that carburetor. I do have another one right here. I don't think it's much better, to be honest. But it is an original, or it's a clone Kohler uh, Command carburetor. But I'm thinking this one here might come back more the machine has ran. It's just been sitting around for a long time. Um, all winter, actually, this, this carburetor was on this engine when this engine was in the zero turn. So it's been sitting around for quite some time, and it could be that's what the problem was as well. Uh, like I said, hopefully it will come back. But this project is almost coming to an end. I definitely need to adjust this seat. I'm actually pretty much all the way up. The uh, seat adjuster is stuck, so i got to work on that. Get the seat adjusted back so I can actually sit on here a little bit easier and actually drive it. So it makes me think someone, a young, sorry, a young kid was definitely driving around this machine. This machine was probably a yard tractor and it's going back to being a yard tractor as well. So there we go. Uh, hoopty build number, I believe this would be number three. Number one's the Murray. Number two is that Craftsman right there. 
and this would be number three. So Hoopty number three finally runs and drives. So talk to me later. Please keep it redneck like always, and uh, please subscribe and comment.